Hello there, welcome to my channel and uh, today I'm excited to share another application to do with inventory management. As you can see, this inventory management application starts with a welcome message. As you can see, it pops up with the main menu where you have buttons that will enable you to navigate to the different parts of your application. You will be able to edit this application according to your needs. You can tailor it to your needs by going to design view. For example, if I wanted to add the name of my company, I just come over here and say ABC Company Limited. can make this large, you can edit the color, maybe to white, whatever color that you want. So once you do that, you'll be able to save this form and uh, once you close the form and start the form again, it will have the name of your company. Here are my contact details. In case you need to contact me, please feel free. And uh, as you can see, you can be able to even edit in case there is an error on the form. These are just for purposes of contacting me. You are free to delete them in your final application. Save and then close. So as you can see, once I double click, it opens the main form and you can see I'll be able to navigate through the different parts of this application. Each button here takes you to a certain location in the database. For example, if I want to add uh, a new item uh, to be purchased, I just click add and I'll be able to use this form to add a new item. If I want to edit an item, just click here, edit an item, and you'll be able to edit the items. You can and as well use the barcode technology to use this application because instead of uh, using uh, the keyboard, I can scan the item ID here such that I'm able to uh, quickly manage my stock with the less uh, typing. I'll be illustrating how to use barcode uh, in this application. You can add supplier. You can edit supplier. You can add customer. You can edit customer. You can check the balance you have in stock or in the store. You can check items that uh, those that have reached the order level. You can view purchases in the period, like how many items you've purchased in the period. You can view items sold in the period. You can view all items in the store. You can be able to see the cost price, sales price, minimum level, maximum level, the location. You can uh, receive stock. Once you set up this part here, you can start receiving stock with ease. I'm going to illustrate this in the next video. You can uh, Edit received stock using this a uh, window. You can uh, make sales, of course, uh, in the case you've started selling the products. Click here, make sales. You can edit sales. So this application can be tailored to your needs. 
and uh, as you can see it is made up of uh, several objects on the right hand side you can see it has it has the uh, forms it has tables it has uh, queries yeah, it has reports so if I close this window and I go to tables I can be even able to edit so you feel free to edit add more information about your customer here once you've edited you close you can be able to edit uh, the items table you can be able to edit the orders table you be able to edit the purchase orders the sales table stock items table and all these tables are interlinked at the best tools you can see how these tables are interlinked so you can be able to uh, go to forms you can always edit these forms then uh, you'll be able to add your uh, color company colors if your color is not green you can be able to add the company colors you are free to edit all these forms according to your needs then we go to uh, queries and edit queries accordingly but the system the way it is it is ready for use it just needs a bit of tweaking here and there you can edit the reports design view you can add for example your logo here you can make all sorts of uh, changes to this application in order for you to tailor it to your needs and requirements so if i take you back to forms i click on main form i have a button for exit once we exit we will be out of this application so once again if you want me to support you to complete your application these are my contact details please feel free to contact me on andrew.semaranda at gmail.com thank you very much for tuning in into my channel please subscribe like and share my video and in my next video i'll be illustrating how this microsoft access inventory system works with a barcode system thank you for now I wish you the best.